Hey, look, man, subscribe to the channel. Welcome back to the channel. Like this video. Hey, share this video. Comment down below as we go along. Look, man, I'm going to explain everything to you, bro. So look, Dolph arm when it was sticking out the window. Y'all got to look at back at them pictures, man. His left arm sticking out the window, and that's the same left arm that had the watch on in the picture with, at the, with the lady, the Ruth Chris. And y'all got to understand, the picture of him at the Ruth Chris was a wax figure. It was a it was the wax museum Young Dolph exhibit. Like they was that was not a real person. If you look at the face, they took two pictures. And how is somebody gonna hold the same exact facial expression with the muscle cheeks and not actually flinch a move? That's cause it's a wax figure. And when you see when you look into the eyes, you see the eyes, they don't have the gloss in it to shine like it's real water in your eyes. That was a clay eyes. So now moving on to the watch, the watch that he had on in the Ruth Chris, that's, that's not the same watch. That's not the same watch because they're not going to be able to get the same baguette watch, that $300,000 AP watch. They're not going to be able to get that same um Richard Milley with diamonds in it on a, on the wax figure because the wax figure is supposed to be for display. So they just put a bust down Rolly on the wax display. Now the watch that's in the picture of him with his arm sticking out the window and his left hand, that that is actually photoshopped because when you look at it, his left arm is sticking out and you see his shoulder, but his entire right arm is missing. Are you kidding me? Y'all didn't see that his entire right arm is missing? That photo that photo is completely photoshopped, just like how the picture with the white bands and the two guys running is photoshopped. Because we told you the street sign shadow is way bigger than the actual street sign. It's humongous. And when you look at it, they um the people's elbows and arm like certain parts of their body is chopped too much. But y'all got to realize the fact that if he's supposed to be laying on the ground like that and his left arm is sticking out the window, his right shoulder is the one that's up above and it doesn't have a, an arm at all attached to it. So that just goes to show you that they took the Richard Milley that he actually was wearing when you look at the video of the gas station. That video of the gas station was from two, three days before the Dolph incident. And he had the Richard Millie with the factory diamonds baguettes in it. And basically, when he had that, you got to understand Richard Millie's are even collectors right nowadays. So they're like, hey, he got all his jewelry on. We set up the thing to do the music video. The fact that they set him up to do the music video means that they purposely planned that so that they can have him all jewelried out and bring his cars and everything. So they were trying to basically take all of his assets that he would bring to the video shoot, the money he was supposed to pick up and everything like that. Now, if everything went straight, you know, Dolph was supposed to just pick up his money and go ahead and leave and go on the airport and fly and go to his hideout like place. Like he's got the hideout, but, and they don't know where that is. That's why you got to understand that having a hideout is good, but you can't actually go back to your Oh, like you really can't no more go back to that hood and once you get the hideout because as soon as you go back to that hood, people are gonna be trying to find you and say, Hey, he's gonna be at the hideout, we're gonna be this is the last chance they get. So man, you gotta open your eyes and see that. And you gotta look at the fact that young Dolph, he had a lot of people that wanted his spot. And you gotta really look at the fact that a lot of people know that it's chess players in this game and a lot of people like really sit back and look at the fact like dang why why this study happening like why they can't figure out what really happened why is so many like things going around the reason for that is y'all need to realize the fact that it was a lot of people who played a part in it so everything has to be confused like they like they they messed it up like, they messed up the whole lick. Black Youngster, he's sitting back mad because he got everybody confused. Black Youngster's not finna 
even make no more music videos right now. But like youngsters, he's sitting back, he looking at the fact that, dang, they called me. They got everything that I had going on, man. They know that I was involved, man. Y'all got to understand, man, when we actually see black youngster go down for what went on, we're going to be like, dang, man, that's sad, man. Why did he have to do that to Dolph? And why did the Bentley have to be even there when this happened? Like, by the Bentley even being there, that ties back to money bag, yo, instantly. So y'all got to look at the fact that he, it's like a domino effect. Like, he knocked, like, he basically knocked down a whole organization just by Keller's moving. You feel, you feel me? Like, you realize you got to sit back and cover your tracks if you do do something. Like, man, R.P. to that man, though. R.P. to Nooski, man. Y'all got to understand, a lot of people was lost during this whole aftermath of what went on. And Dolph, he really had a lot to say. He really had a lot going on that people, like, they didn't want that in they, they didn't want that in Memphis, like, real life. Like, yo, God, he didn't want it in Memphis. I'm going to just say it. He didn't want it in Memphis, man. Hey, man, and you got to understand that the reason they got caught up, and there's a lot of evidence coming out, and this facts is that, they seen the tire marks of the Bentley leaving and his tire marks right there on the side of the family dollar and Makita's that shows those tires size and the shape of the tread is back to only that type of Bentley that Moneybag Yo has. So that's how Moneybag Yo got caught up too. And then y'all got to understand that they already seen Black Youngster's footprint in that back door that he stepped in a puddle and stepped on that, uh, like by, by that back door area. It's like a gray floor, and boom, footprint right there. He had on off white Air Force Ones, and it's only certain people that have those type of shoes. It's expensive. Black Yumps is one of them who bought it because they have records from, they have the records from the stores, uh, from the Saks Fifth that shows that Black Youngster literally bought that. Uh, Air Force One off white in cash and pay for the whole thing without using no credit cards. And he signed the piece of paper that way it came back to him. So, look, y'all can't sign no pieces of paper. And the other thing is, is that Yo Gotti's involved because even though he almost got away, but the fact that he made one big mistake, he spit on the ground on the concrete on the side of Makita's and Family Dollar before they hopped in the Bentley before money bag yo floored it too hard and left the tire marks. So when they went back and said it was somebody that's on the phone that was like, yeah, one of the guys I think was like spitting, they like put it, they went to take pictures of it. They sent that to a lab and the spit came back to Yo Gotti. It literally came back with a piece of paper that said Yo Gotti spit. And then that's how they connected it to him. Um, the second thing is, is that that same witness who was on the phone seen Maurice pull up and Maurice pulled up in the Lincoln with the black top and the red interior and he came out they knew it was Maurice because they thought he had a hat on but it was his dreads and that's a clear giveaway that that's exactly Maurice and he got caught up so that goes to show you that that is proof that you need to subscribe to the channel like this video and go ahead and comment down below what you think if you agree or disagree and if you support young Dolph, comment that below and like this video and also subscribe to the channel and if you're new to the channel make sure you also subscribe as well